The Money Show in London. I'm here with Len Kolf, the Chief Geologist of Iron Ridge Resources. Uh, Len, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Angela. Give us an introduction to Iron Ridge. Now, you've got a few very interesting projects in, in locations with perhaps different commodities than we would sure. normally expect in these locations. Sure. So tell us about these. Okay, so Iron Ridge, uh, we're listed on AIM, uh, Brisbane-based uh, and African-focused mm -hmm. exploration and development company. Mm -hmm with an exciting lithium pegmatite discovery in Ghana and some pretty exciting gold um, portfolio in Chad mm -hmm. and uh, in Ivory Coast our mm -hmm. pipeline of new growth gold projects. Okay, now I want to touch on the uh, Ghana lithium project first because obviously lithium is not a commodity that we associate with, mm. um, with Ghana, it's much more gold focused. Yeah. So how did you come across this property and what you know what are you seeing um, in terms of the geology at the at the property sure um really um the Brumian has been the focus of gold exploration over the last you know decades and longer even uh, however it's highly prospective for lithium too and companies up in mali have proven the case you know there's some 100 million plus ton lithium resources that have now been defined there uh, so with that in mind, we completed a top-down geological review, desktop detailed geological review of the whole Barimian, and through that process uh, came across um, occurrences, lithium occurrences in Ghana and Ivory Coast. It was actually a, a reference to a master's thesis completed in the 70s by a Ghanaian female geologist really? at the University of Leicester that alerted me to the opportunity in Ghana. So this, um, we dug deeper, went to Ghana, and then discovered that uh, a lithium deposit had actually been drilled by the Ghana Geological Survey in the 70s, okay. uh, but then really forgotten about in the annals of time and I guess the focus on gold. Yeah, yeah. So what are you doing there now? What kind of work are you doing at the moment? Well, so we've secured a large portfolio, 684 square kilometers on the Cape Coast, uh, literally within 100 kilometers to the operating deep sea port of Takaradi, 100 kilometers to Accra, fantastic location from an infrastructure point of view and we've just finished our first drill program uh, just over 8,000 meters RC. Mm -hmm. Now in Chad you have what could be a company maker itself, mm. um, very early stage gold project. Talk to us about that. Right, so Chad uh, is uh, not a well known or understood mm -hmm. jurisdiction. Uh, it has seen a lot of investment in the oil and gas space with uh, Total Glencore having invested millions of dollars in oil refinery. Uh, however, the, the, the mineral sector has just been forgotten about. Uh, that's changing now, and we see all the right rocks and huge geological upside there. Uh, so we've now uh, secured a 900 square kilometer portfolio with our partners there, and uh, completed over 15 kilometers of trenching over our most advanced project, which is called Dorothy. Mm. It's a large footprint, three kilometer long by one kilometer wide, area of uh, past artisanal mining. Okay, okay. Well, uh, Len, looking forward, you've, the company's just secured um, over five million pounds financing. What's, uh, you know, what's on the sh agenda for the uh, shareholders over the next right. year? Right, um, yeah, it's going to be a busy year. Uh, we just closed a 5.4 million pound raising. Uh, this was last Tuesday. And uh, we've got the rigs uh, on site drilling in Ghana now. Uh, so we've got an RC program and then we'll switch over to a diamond program to help feed into our maiden resource uh, targeting Q2 next year. Mm -hmm. uh, we are also um, busy on the ground in Ivory Coast where we've got air mag surveys underway and uh, trenching and pitting programs and regional soils. It's more of our early stage program. Mm -hmm. And in Chad, uh, we've got our field crew back on the ground now doing a geophysical survey over Dorothy. And with the basis of that data and our results to date, we'll decide the next steps there, drilling or advancing our Kalaka project. Mm -hmm. Well, Len, it's very interesting, uh, very interesting project. So uh, we'll be following the story closely. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you.